A conference to help connect Korean female leaders across the globe was held in Seoul. Known as the Korean Women's International Network, this year marks its 20th anniversary. Min Su Kyun was at the event. Hundreds of Korean women from all walks of life gathered both online and offline to inspire and motivate others to lead. When I see the successes of Korean and Korean diaspora women around the world, it makes me proud, not just because of our natural affinity, but because I know each woman has survived, thrived, failed, and succeeded through their own life's journey. We can all learn from each other that way. The 20th Korean Women's International Network, organized by the Ministry of Gender, Equality and Family, invited some 300 Korean female leaders across 27 countries to join this year's conference held at the Plaza Hotel in Seoul. The two-day event from August 30th featured several panel discussions and networking opportunities. The topics discussed include the role of women in global health security. Health security does not have clear boundaries, and since the world is connected, it's difficult to solve health issues without collective efforts. I hope more women step into healthcare related industries and demonstrate their capabilities in ways that will add value to society. Participants also discuss the impact of climate change on women, ways to increase their participation in the environmental sector, and approaches to ensure their safety. The Korean Women's International Network was established with the launch of the Ministry of Gender Equality and Family in 2001, and this year marks the organization's 20th anniversary. As Cohen celebrates its 20th anniversary, I hope Korean women, based on their experiences, will be able to jointly address the problems of the local and international community with their diverse and inclusive leadership. For the past 20 years, Cohen has been a place for Korean women to share their experiences, connect and increase female representation in leadership roles. So far, more than 9,000 women from 61 countries have taken part in the event. Min Suk-kyun, Arirang News.